does affect two parcels. Uh, Mr. Hatton owns the subdivided parcel. Obviously, he's the owner of the medicine shop. Uh, he is here as well. Uh, representative from, representatives from both National Ventures are here. Uh, we'll try and keep Mike and Mike in their seats. But I'll, I'll be brief. I know y'all had a long day. Uh, we're, we're at the end here. Um, pretty straightforward request. The ordinance requires six staffing spaces. That would mean um, to seven cars, actually. Staffing spaces are behind gardens in the driveway. Uh, the applicants are requesting that that be diminished to three staffing spaces so that there would be uh, an upper end or a row of four in the driveway. Um, like Mr. Todd said, the, we believe the intent of, of the ordinance, if they're strictly applied, would really create a hardship for this type of use. Uh, commonly, when you think about drive throughs you think about things, fast food establishments have much more uh, stacking of cars in their line um, than any pharmacy. Uh, I think Mr. Hatton, and, and I don't want to speak for him, but I did talk to him this morning and asked him to be here because I do think it's important that, that y'all understand in his current location on Windermere, uh, Mr. Lawrence is building is right next door. He probably sees it every day. There's not much space there from where the drop through window is in the actual street. And he never has any stacking problems. There might be enough space there for Cars. Um, so we don't anticipate a problem in this new location. I'm happy to stay up here and answer any questions you may have. But, uh, any, uh, any questions, any discussion? Anyone else here in support? Huh? Everybody sitting over here is in support. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if they want to get up and say right. something. I'll speak to Robert Hadden, 402 River Street, House of Georgia. Um, our, our normal business practices are such that, that we encourage the drive through for drop off and pick up a prescription only. Uh, it's not for uh, having to feel like weight. Um, actually, since we're putting a gift shop in the store, I would like them to come around the park and come in and wait. So, uh, but uh, we do encourage and try to educate our customers that it is for uh, they haven't previously contacted the pharmacy for dropping off. You know, so our wait time is very minimal. <laughs> I'm not saying anything. You hurt my feelings. Does anyone here in opposition to this request, or does anyone here have a question about what it being requested? Okay. Any other discussions or questions? Can I entertain a motion on this request? I have a motion. From Ms. Gaskins, I have a second from Mr. McLean to I'm sorry, to call the correct Yes. Uh, all in favor of the motion, please raise your hand. Unanimous. Good luck with you, gentlemen. Thank you. Thank you. Now, would you like to address the board or not? It's better if you say this, too. I'm wrong. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank we are built. I'll wait until you approve that. Okay. Thank you, Mike. All right. Have minutes. Anybody have a question? Any other correction? I have a question about the minutes. Now that we have an attendance policy, could we have another category that says member first excuse rather than absent? Because I think that I didn't get excused. I, I think I got an excuse. I can, I can put in, I can change the yeah. number of excuses. Yeah. Do you want me to do that on this minute? Yeah. Or, no, on this one. Okay. Just because we weren't absent, we were excused. Okay. Uh, and we do agree that to get excused, we just call you and tell you. Right. Yeah. And then the chairman says that it's okay. Right. Or contact me. I can do that. Okay. Uh, one other correction. Chairman Strickland didn't thank everyone for coming. Oh, uh -huh.
Okay, with the correction, can I get a motion to approve minutes? So moved. Second. Second. All in favor, please raise a hand. Thank you very much. Any other or new business, old business, anything we need to talk about? Stand adjourned. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for your time. No, I guess you might want to park it with the mayor. I apologize, Mac. I don't know where my mind was. No, no, it's all right. No, Mac. And out, yeah. I'm coming in class and follow me, gentlemen. Oh, my God. I need to take notes. I'm going to kiss my brother. I don't know where that is. I'm going to kiss you. 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 I'm going to kiss you.